be doing here, but it's all good. So when I got to Australia, one of the first things I set out to do was to see a colony of real life wild flying foxes. So we headed off to an area known for them and it was outstanding. Um, if you take a listen, you can pretty much understand why people aren't too happy about them when they roost in their neighborhoods, but I for one would gladly accept our wind overlords. I mean, look how cool they are. And listen to it, it's just amazing. So I wanted to share with you. Enjoy. Trying to get a close from back. They're not happy about me being here, but you guys see the freaking awesome? They're everywhere. I have to seriously be batshit crazy not to love Australia. Some of you asked about the tawny frogmouth that I had taken the picture of the other day. This is what they look like when they're awake. You can see they have amazing camouflage and strong bites, oh! But um, they're really awesome, awesome birds. And they're kind of the equivalent of our owls in North America. They're these really amazing nocturnal predators. This is it. It's that incredible camouflage that you saw. And they put their heads up and close their eyes and they pretty much look like a piece of wood. And yeah, he's not really happy about me holding on to him. But it's okay. Shh, it's okay. But yeah, he's a great bird. So yeah, be jealous. Because we're talking Tony. That's a uh, right? piece of plastic. Stay here. Don't go away. Don't fly away. I'm sure you're expensive. I'm a cooler pirate than you are. Arg. <laughs> well, he's gonna take my eye out. I'm really gonna look like a pirate.